What is up, my Squirtalites? It is I, your king, welcoming you back to more Let's Play Destiny. In the last episode, we acquired the last three pieces of the Dream Bane armor set. And with the set fully equipped, we can head off to the mission beyond and finally find a way towards the pyramids. Now we have a couple of changes here. So I got my Waking Vigil hand cannon, which is something that I happen to get from Reward in the Dreaming City. It's got Outlaw and Dragonfly, should be fun to use. Bad Juju here for a little bit longer range damage. Not too much longer, but it's enough that it'll get the job done in this mission. I also, at the very end of the last episode, got enough levels to get to level 35, which gives us the Manticore Exotic and an Ikelos weapon, which is the Ikelos Shotgun, one that is going to go straight into the Postmaster, unfortunately, because my energy weapon slots are full. Oh, goody. That's okay, though. I am not going to deviate from what we're actually using. Let's head on over there towards that marker and get this mission started. So no exotics going into this. And I do believe you can change your armor after you start the mission. I could be wrong about that, but I think you can. Either way, I am going to run the entire mission as is and just deal with it. I don't think it's going to be too big of an issue, but yeah, it's not going to obviously be ideal. So I'm seriously using Waking Vigil just because it's arc and it's going to work very well with my arc subclass for this so i know i will have a lot of fun being able to destroy things with this even though this isn't actually all that great of a hand cannon if i could be completely honest with you this is about the best roll that you can get with it if i could be completely honest so let's uh head on up here get this mission started and off we go lies ahead of us. That pyramid destroyed so many lives so long ago. Getting inside is paramount. We must find something, anything to help us prepare for their violent return. Remember to keep your wits about you. We do not know what tricks they may play within. No, we don't. But we'll have to find out for ourselves. So we've already went down this path before in the very first mission in the campaign. But I get the feeling there's going to be a little bit more to it. Let's head down. And there are some important things to note about this mission once it really gets going. Right now we're just kind of heading down the path we took in the first mission. Don't really concern yourself with every, anything else. I don't even think that the Thrall spawn in at the rate they used to. We're going to hurry through this very quickly. As much as, and as quickly as we can. All the way down to where the actual pyramid is at. So we got through that in no time. The pyramid is waiting. Yeah, ghost? That doesn't seem like a good sign. Let's just head around through here. And then we'll be out in the open. Where we ran into that... Nightmare of Gaul and Crota before. Here we go. Alright, let's kill everything in here. We got a lot of enemies to deal with. Okay. Hello, knight. Go away. Thank you. Get those reloads. Perfect. Okay, we are now amplified, which is good for me. Now I can reload a whole lot quicker. That wizard is running all the heck away, but we can deal with it like that. Kill everything over here. These Thrall die to those explosions so easily. And we got those. Perfect. Kill all of you. I think I've pretty much got everything here. So now I can continue, right? Uh-oh. Hold on. This doesn't seem good. It beckons us to come closer. Like... Where at exactly? How do we get down to it? I guess let's keep moving. And we'll find out. Violence, beauty, truth. These things await inside. There's no turning back now. Thank you. 
Welcome. We've been waiting. Well, I guess we're stuck here now. Let's find out what's inside. Okay. So. Ghost. Are you, like, part of them now? Or are you just, like, speaking for them? Are they speaking through you? Uh, something about this isn't quite right. Is that... Is that a gall I see? I do believe it is. Oh, gosh, we're here. Oh, this is the fight. We're literally here. What in the heck? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, hold on. Let me get that going and do all the damage I can. Oh, gosh. Okay, this is uh, fun. Uh, great. Okay, keep hitting him. Keep hitting him. Oh, he is immune. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. All right, let's get that damage in. I probably should be using bad juju here because bad juju gets me that... Sweet, sweet, sweet super energy. If I can actually get String of Curses uh, to continue. Come on. Almost got him. There we go. All right. There you are. There you are. There you are. Get him. Oh, I just missed him. Oh, you got to be kidding me. I thought I had the freaking angle correct. I should have definitely checked that before I tried. All right. Well, I'm just going to use all my machine gun ammo here. There we go. That's enough. It's something. I should have knocked him to the ground first. Well, he's immune anyway now. It's okay. It's okay. All right. Let's take out the rest of these things. Now we got Nightmare War Beasts, which is not very fun. All right. Hold on. Whoop, 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 whoop. I'm going to punch you. Do that to get the chain lightning going. Kill you. Just keep, just keep doing that. Keep doing that. No, get the punch in. Thank you. Jeez. All right. For some reason, I only had to kill two of them to make him vulnerable that time. I don't know how that works exactly but hold on if i can get close to you don't do it don't do it oh man oh we're good the red war saw so many lives lost saw the light taken away so easily in light there is only weakness okay Oh no, not the fanatic. Alright, and our next challenge. Yes, we have to fight this guy again. In much the same way that we did end the Forsaken campaign itself. That was a lot of damage right there. I mean, do we have to go all the way th through his health? Or do we actually, can we take him out uh, another way? I honestly don't know. Do we, do we have to outright kill him? I hope not. I get the feeling that's going to be a little bit difficult. I'm barely avoiding his shots. There we go. Oh, man, I wish I had heavy for this. I keep shooting him. There we go. That's some pretty good damage. How much more do we got to do? Got another phase here. Oh, I was going to run up in melee, but those are screebs, so never mind. There we go. Oh, come here. Get me that melee. I tried to slide there, and it didn't work super well. Got him. Okay. Whoa, okay. Hello there, friend. Ah! Shoot. There's more. There's more. Here they come. Watch out for other screebs. There are definitely more enemies spawning somewhere. Just a moment. Oh, hold on. There he goes. He's teleporting. Come on. Get him weak. I think we got him. Oh, no. We, not quite. Not quite. Okay. Yeah. Keep firing that. There we go. Whew. The light. Abandoned Cade, left him for dead, and kept him from being saved. I mean, I suppose you could say that. I would also argue that he was very much trapped. Oh, not Crota. Oh yeah, it's Crota, all right. Here we go. All right, let's start by killing the sword bearer first. Take this relic. Let's go fight the guy. Although that is a significantly smaller crota than I remember. Interesting. What's up, dude? No, you don't. Okay. Get that the three hit combo in there. And then I'm going to do a ground pound to... Oh, gosh, I lost the sword. I lost the sword. I lost the sword. Run. Run. Get away. Get away. Get away. Chain that lightning. There we go. All right, let's find that sword bearer nightmare and also kill off all of his uh, nightmare buddies. 
Perfect. Kill them all. Hello. 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 Oh, I actually have a machine gun here. Kill all of them. There we go. Now he is vulnerable. Hurry. There we go. Knocked him down. Three hit combo. Remember, light, light, heavy. And there we go. One by one, Crota slaughtered many guardians. The light stood by and did nothing. And a great disaster ensued. In light, there is only death. heard your cries for help and soon we will answer who are you don't you recognize us we are not your friend we are not your enemy we are your salvation 